Here we're asked to find the limit as x approaches 2 of f of x, given that the function here is defined as a piecewise function, f of x equals x squared plus 1 if x is not equal to 2, or it equals 7 if x is equal to 2. Let's begin by sketching this graph and having a look at what we really have. And so this is just going to be a rough sketch. x squared plus 1 is a parabola shifted up one unit, something like that. And um, here, that's for values that are not equal to 2. So at, at the x value of 2, we're redefined at 7. So there's like a hole here. And then the redefinition here maybe say is 7. OK, so what we want to do is look for the limit as x approaches 2 from the left and as x approaches 2 from the right. So as x approaches 2, notice x is not really equal to 2. We're trying to find the y value, right? The y values where when x approaches 2 from the left, that's going to be this value here, and that's what we're after. When x approaches 2 from the right, notice they're both going to the same place. And so to do this, notice since x is not equal to 2, what we're going to do is use x squared plus 1 for the function because that's where we're tending, right, to 2. It's not equal to 2. So this would be equal to the limit as x approaches 2 of x squared plus 1. In this particular case, we're going to use the x squared plus 1. And then since that's a polynomial, we can do direct substitution. x is equal to 2, so we'd have 2 squared plus 1. And the limit there is 5. So coming back to my picture over here, now I know this value. Sorry about that. Now I know this value right here is 5. Right? That's the y value to which it's tending. But do notice that the function is redefined at 7. That has nothing to do with the limit. All right? So there we go. The limit is 5.